everybody welcome back to another episode of cyberpunk 2077 we are sure to meet with taki mura why the right sit you are do trying not to look so bad, so bad. then in the car i doubted you would survive why do you help me anyway yeah i needed you to leave that hasn't changed. I'm a frozen. This is about the biochip. Oh, that why I'm here. Mm. I hear it's damaged beyond the repair. Any attempt to extract it will be disastrous. Fatal for you. Vic likes to talk, I guess. Not many could do what he did. You should be thankful. Yeah, I know. What do you actually want from me? To begin, you must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Evelyn, what's she to you? She and Yorino Barasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. You thinking I ought to have a word with her myself? She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone very far away. Why you figure she skipped town? I tried to locate her, but had no yeah. success. I suspect she covered her tracks. You said Parker could help you remove the relic. Does she work for a corporation? Got no clue. Evelyn was knowledgeable about the relic. Had a large chunk of classified info. An enigma to be sure, but she showed that slyness he get in corpo agents. You know the kind. I too possess this slyness you speak of. You got tossed out, lumped with the outcasts, easily. Or have you forgotten? Hmm. Sorry I couldn't be of any help. Don't have any time to lose, so... Hey, wait. I need you. Yorino Murasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. Looking for justice in Night City. I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. I have allies prepared to bring Yorino to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. And you think they'll trust the word of a merc? I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. What if I say no? Then I will tell you what rewards await if you help me. So what? We stroll on to Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered um, Subaru? I don't think that's gonna work. We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. Certain procedures will be used to establish the truth. A lie detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. Achi, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. This corporation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics. Cool. What kind of people? Exactly what kind of people are we talking about? People who hold Arasaka dear. Ah, uh, it's hot. People interested in the corporation's stable growth. You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Prep for the heist, thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true, he's a pawn. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Besides, Anders Hellman escaped to Arasaka, betrayed it. Ha! 
花子様お会いできて光栄ですこちらこそ Now, Hanako sama, I would first like to ask you. Fucking soccer scums everywhere. Hey, hey I was I listening to that. to that. Shut up. Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt. What did you say? You heard me. Let it go, Takamura. Hmm. At least one of you's got some fucking sense. You dumbass. You should have not drawn attention to ourselves. Last thing we want to do is to draw attention. I'm sorry. I stupid the reflex. Thanks for the offer. Need to think about it. Get back to you. I need time to plan, organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is that you do not leave the city. Leave? Why would I leave? Need help. Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we just talked about some. There's no time to waste me. Huh. Anders Helm. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Somebody's been busy the last few days. I will not sit and do nothing when there is information to be found. Things to prepare. Your job, basically. It was my job. Then your boss got killed. Defected? Where to? Who's fault is that? As far as I can tell, he acted alone. A meticulous man. He planned it. Covered his tracks very well. Any idea where he took off to? None. Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Saburo san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corporal rats will squeal when hanging by their tails. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place, the club called the Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the queen of fixers there, Rogue. Mean to say you worked for Saburo, yet got no idea how to talk to the high and mighty. She wished to have nothing to do with the man accused of murdering Saburo Arasaka. Rogue's well informed. Gets wind of most things that happen in the city. Might be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. The old man is choosy, expensive, and rude. With a bit of luck. I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she will not manage to now. Honor among thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes. I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. There's just honor, I believe. Your noble Arasaka would agree, I'm sure. The Parker woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about a plan B. I cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Hellman, whoever. I must see some friends. 
call in some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call you. Till then, I guess. If by some miracle you find Hellman, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. Zapper dumples and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. Arasaka's still a despotic machine and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. You know, you got some nerve. First you had to kill me, now you want to be my pal. Make like nothing happened. You know you don't gotta speak out loud to talk to me. What do you want? And I've processed some shit, changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. Go fuck yourself, dick wipe. Hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. And I've taken a step back, looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. Why should I trust you? Remind me again. Trust me, don't trust me. I don't give a fuck. It's the least of our worries, anyway. You're the ghost of Christmas past, okay. asshole. Any Christmas past, I don't dead, understand that. So old, their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died on the legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know, Rogue. What do I say to him? Got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. Don't need convincing. Seen your memories, gross. Rogel danced any tune I play or just get us to the afterlife. There is no us. What's <laughs> this? Hey, look. Oh, interesting. Would you look at that? You see it too, right? You've gone completely whacked when I'm having a mystical moment. What's that chick's name? The one with the hair? Misty? Eh, more likely a neuron misfire for Victor to check out. Or maybe I ask you both. Uh, I don't mean to call you. Damn. Ooh, that's very nice. She's typing. Oh, okay. Must have uh, talked to Evelyn. Didn't need to. Old damn city, city. Listen, need to find Evelyn. I really don't want to talk about this. 
You know where she is? What I just said. Drop it. I want to. Judy, you're my one hope. The only lead I got. Yes. Gotta find her. I need to find her. Who told you I do it? Um, we I did. Meet. Let's meet, please. You at Lizzie's? It gets kind of boring when you do it for a long time. Hey! Haven't I seen you here before? Yeah, like two times already. Got a good memory for faces. Part three. We're closed right now. I'm uh, looking for Evelyn Parker. Know where I might find her? Used to come around. Haven't seen her in a while though. Need to talk to Punch and Judy. She in her den? Yep. Take the stairs down. I'll let Judy know you're coming. I the tiger, babe. Whoa, whoa. Start again. What is it you want us to do now? Beat some I thought you were close. That don't work. I don't know. Use lead. I Is that my name? Oh. Judy's embarrassing herself again. Hey, where are you going? Nothing to say back here. Why? Judy's friend. You done with that, Bakulio? Yeah. I'm friend. I, I want to, but she doesn't Stop want to. Stop telling every joy toy you need to come here. The hell I'm supposed to do with them all? I don't. Must be our rep. Girls need help, they come here. Last time I checked, we weren't running a shelter. Come on, they all deserve a chance. Why are you looking at Give it some time, they'll pay for themselves. Hey! Chicks can barely take care of themselves. Not when they're face down in the mud. But who knows? Surprise. I hate surprises. Mm-hmm. Really feeling that sense of community right now. We're not done here. Oh, yeah, we fucking are. Wanted to ask you something. Not now. You just don't give up, do you? Got nothing more to say to each other. What was that all about? Everyone in this city lives in their own goddamn bubble. And either you fly high or sink into quicksand. What's up with Susie seems to know what she wants. She your boss? You come all this way just to play who's who at the mocks? Alright, I'm looking for Evelyn. Listen, listen. Have you seen Evelyn? Need to talk to her. It's important. Why? So you can make her your scapegoat for your train wreck of a heist. Need to find out who she was working for. That's it? That's it. That's it. Judy, you don't need to worry. I won't lay a hand on it. Wouldn't make sense. Fine, fine. All right. Evelyn's a doll. Used to work at Clouds. Sig case on my table's got the address. Take it, and once you find Evelyn, give it to her. Megat's tower. Luxurious. That all? Mm -hmm. Wait, wait. Um, just let me know how she's doing. Okay. I'll give you a call, okay? Thanks. Thank you, V. A doll. 
Why am I not surprised? You're an engram in a fading mind. Nothing should surprise you anymore. So we're gonna hit this place, Clouds? Why the hell not? Club's closed. Don't you have somewhere to be? He did exchange there with Judy. What was that all about? How's this any of your business? Gonna follow up with your own sermon on responsibility for others? Go on, your high horse is waiting. I'm just curious. One thing I know about curiosity won't get you shit unless you got the fists and the ass to back it up. I'm guessing the club brings in a lot of biz. This is a share of cars, too. Why? Did you invest? Nah. Admiring your operation. We took over this place way back when. Every day I wake up and wonder how it's still standing. We get by. That's all I'll say. Where do you give the working girls a helping hand? That's ancient history. And like all history, it was pretty damn bloody. What was it? Something about a riot. Joy girl murdered by a tiger claw? Not the first, just the one that tipped the scales. Folk went ballistic. Streets overflowed with raised fists. Girls, pimps, outcasts, the whole freak show. It's how the mocks got started. But that's old news. We're running a business now, not a charity. Can't help everyone in this city. Gotta take care of our own. Moxes come first. You know what happened to Evelyn Parker? Why are you asking me? You talked to Judy about her already. Sure, but you're the boss. You might know something more. Evelyn jumped the Mox ship a long time ago. And anyone not a Mox is not my damn problem. Forget Evelyn. Admit it. This is about Judy's virtues, isn't it? Good shit, if I say so myself. Nobody can hold a candle to Judy. She cuts virtues like they were diamonds. Damn straight. Huh. What's this? Oh, fuck off. The name is Hazes, Mr. Hazes. If you're looking for word in Pacifica, I'm the man to call. I'm V. No, nice to meet you. All right. How very nice to meet you. If you have business, you know my number. Oh, yeah, how about a lot of missions? Let's see the time. Oh, it's a... <laughs> Holy shit, that the jump scared me. <laughs> I thought they were gunners.
roof blue car very nice is it fast yes Dude, that looks like a real revolver. Ooh! Where? I need 20. Okay! It's 46 and this is... And the real turn time is 8.5. This is... Very good, okay. If it's ten, is if it's ten, is twenty one, so nineteen. Yeah. Some macho, some macho, some macho. Hmm. These three are very strong. Wait, what's this though? Oh, tier 5? Do I have any tier 4? Get me really check. I need more tier 5 to... Yeah, tier 2. You can play more after this video if I'm not doing any more quests. Do some, you know, normal stuff, but I will not do anything major or even the side mission. So I'm just gonna kill people, get more weapons, guns. If I'm lucky, I might get more iconic weapons. Let me get more uh, some more still. Barry, I Barry. remember that right. Should have not died. So you debug. Your neighbor Sean? Yeah, he deserves remember to me? die. Talked about prime rights. Back then, you were pumped about the. You gave me the. I remember. What do you want? I just want to see what was shaking. Friends say you never leave your unit. Think I've got an inkling as to why. I've seen that look before. 
It's all too common among people like us. Us? <laughs> you don't look like a cop. Badges don't get a monopoly on loss. You see death every day in my line of work. And you get used to it, of course, until it hits someone you're close to. You too. Yeah. Exactly. Come in. I lost, I lost someone close to me, close too. To A damn good friend. What do you mean, too? It's about Andrew. He, uh... Told you about him. Best part I ever had. Known in my whole life. Only person I could spill to without being judged. I'm guessing things at the NCPD haven't changed a lick, huh? One time... time. A maelstrom ganger killed a young kid right in front of my eyes. For shits and giggles. Damn. I couldn't do shit. The son of a bitch had corporal protection. I wish I would be there. I would. Our chief greases his palms with it. I wish I was there. So I can kill him before you do, do anything. Kid blew his own brains out. Right in front of your eyes. Something died in him. Couldn't do it anymore. A few months later, Andrew passed, and everything went to shit. You didn't have anyone to unload on at work? How about Petrova and Mendez? Petrova's a decent gal, but she's not good with her stuff. Mendez says, just doesn't get it. He thinks us blues need to be tough. Can't bear the sight of a kid getting murdered. Born with pussy jeans. Well, you told him about Andrew. Honestly, thought about it a lot. Anyway, they don't know everything. Better that way. You sound like Jockey, a little. Doesn't matter. Normally, from old age. It's no wonder, seeing as he was only a few years younger than my grandma. Dying of old age? In Night City? That merits a monument. Old world should gaze up at it in awe. <laughs> Ashbox and the ninja will have to do. So then Andrew is more like a grandpa to you than a friend? Hmm. Didn't go that far. It was like, uh... He reminded me of my gram grams about our little talks. Time when everything had its proper place. You know? He yeah. was the last <laughs> living record of those times. Mendez doesn't know shit about life. Everyone's got their limits, even him. He just hasn't reached them. Not like you. What if he's right, though? Maybe my genes are soft. Don't only the strongest survive. If he felt nothing, that means his loss wouldn't have had any meaning. I guess so. Thanks for the talk, V. I am. Um, I need time to take all this in. Sure thing. Take care. Take care. Hope you get better, man. Where is that? Just over there. You have any missions here? Oh yeah, that. But where is that? 
mission that it well, that's the after life after what it's right here right no here what the hell is a uh, is a lot farther than I thought Okay, let's do that, you know, later. Let's talk to Misty, then Victor. Oh, shit. Oh. Need to get that air dash. Yeah, there's an air dust in this game. Won't be getting it anytime soon. Damn, so high. Oh, oh well, I'm dead. That's the end of the story. V, v falling to his death. Don't tell me what to do. Oh, I'm so far out. Hey, we got This elevator is so slow. What's this? Saw a weird image out on the street. Uh, seems like your line of work. What it looked like. I grabbed the scan. Take a look. Tarot, Major Arcanum. What you saw was a sign from a higher power. What? The what now? Major Arcanum. Tarot card, archetype, knowledge held in symbolic form, a stage in your journey through life. Take your pick. Either way, you're saying some higher power is talking to me through tarot cards. Or to Silverhand, or both of you, seeing as you form a harmonious whole at the moment. 
know, it'd be a little easier if this higher power learned to be direct. Well, the world is a maze of illusions. It's not easy for the light to shine into the prison of our earthly existence. Right. Great. So, what do I do with a sign I can't understand from a power I know nothing about? I'd start by looking for more of them. The tarot describes a road, so go down it. So, if I collect all of them... Still don't know what I'm supposed to do with what I find. Look for more images. They must have some connection to the place where you find them. Think about what you see. You ask me? They've been sent to help you find the truth. Finding the truth is pretty far down on my list at the moment. A difficult time is coming when you'll have to choose which road to take. Then, you'll understand. I don't know. Come on back when you've found more. I'll help you decipher what you've seen. Oh yeah, thanks, Missy. From Pokemon. Misty. Got a few questions about Silverhand and his chip. I'm no expert, but fire away. See what I can do. Tried to flatline me. Johnny did. What? What can I do to suppress him? You know, avoid my murder. Well, as long as you don't give him control, can't do too much harm. Of course, that won't necessarily be possible after some time. And what then? Sadly. You say we don't let things get that far. Find a way to get rid of Silverhand and fast. How is it even possible? Seeing him. Well, that biochip is designed for users to communicate with constructs. It's just doing its job. So I got our socket to thank. You know, I wager you have the lowest net worth of any relic owner out there. Hmm. Why am I reliving Johnny's memories? You too share a brain now. He has access to your senses, perceptions, even some memories. Likewise, you've got a glimpse into his. After a while, you won't even know whose is whose. Listen. Don't laugh, uh, but I've been seeing some weird shit around town, like murals or something. But I know they're not real. Uh, just a Kuroshi blimp. Could take a look. No, no, the images are too. That case is the biochip. Brain can't handle it. <sighs> Keep... Nope. Think. Okay, let's add some more shit. Bad. What? The socks. I got to lose all my life before I get to um. I can slow down there. Oh, we are 
right now, David. Yes. Finally. Finally. Okay, we need better melee. Seems we don't have that. Hearing any more fireworks? Well, I can't add any more, but we can now slow down time for eight seconds by fifty percent. Thanks, Victor. You're your best, best doctor. Wait, rip doc out there. Joseph and fireworks. Checking them out. Where's my toy yeah. knife? Get those oh yeah, we have the new knife. The very good one. That boat talks. Their bodies, they never ate. But notice their eyes, cold and dead. Their corporation exists only oh, yeah, to live for, for on this for a while. To remain undead. You guys, you guys I tell you now, just... the borough is not gone from our world. He rests undisturbed in the family. He feasts on the blood of his servants, awaiting his body. Wouldn't be told, Shaka. Said on TV, our saga is working on immortality tech. A hollow lie to conceal their inhuman nature. Its source flows not through technology, but through their undead blood. But how could mere mortals become these death-defying abominations, you ask? With the help of techno necromancers from out the Centauri, it was their tainted blood Saburo Arasaka drank to transform himself into this devil spawn. Gary, you can't spill Arasaka's secret. They gonna find you. Let them. The seed has been sown. The truth shall sprout roots and lift us from the invaders' clutches. I recognize you. You come here often. Your eyes tell me that your mind has opened to the truth. Will you provide a humble donation so that I may continue my mission? Nothing but lint in my pockets. Sorry. Never say the same the thing. Group. Let those with ears yeah. listen and those with not. eyes behold. <coughs> Their mothership conceals itself above our very heads. Ready yourself, for they are coming. Open your mind before it is too late. If you turn a blind eye to their existence, they have already won! Radio waves bear the truth. Let those with ears listen and those with um. eyes behold. 
Their mothership conceals itself above our very heads! Ready your team! I get that later on my own without recording. So anyway guys, like, subscribe and hit the bell. See you next time on Cyberpunk. Oh I can do this. Why is my character doing that? Why am I doing this for a uh, picture, a uh, title? Shit. Well, screw this. Anyway, this topic. Oh, like, subscribe, and hit the bell. Bye, guys. Happy New Year.